I'd just like to say thanks to all my subscribers, all my followers. Thank you very much. Appreciate you all very, very much. I'm uh, thinking about doing some rebranding, and I, I need all your help. Um, I'd like you to put in the comments what you think, um, the kind of videos that you like, um, what you think you'd like for me to do and to make videos of. Um, I feel like I'm pretty stagnant, not moving anywhere. Um, my subscriber count proves that. And I know I can do better. I just need some some of your all help to find a little niche that you think that I might be able to fulfill. Um, I have obviously all the time in the world. I I live alone in my van 24 hours a day, and I need um, something special to do. So, if you could please chime in and, and uh, make some comments about what you'd like for me to do as videos, um, or what you think I should be doing, or give me your thoughts on what you like. Um, maybe I could pick up some good ideas and get out of my stagnant little uh, lull I've got here going. Um, I don't even feel like making videos at times. Um, sometimes I just don't know what um, I'm thinking about you all and, and what you would like. And I just can't come up with anything um, new and different. Or It just seems to be stuck in this, this rut. So if you could all help, um, please. Um, I said put in the comments down below what you think I, I should be doing. <coughs> I do have a, a lot more potential. I've got a lot of things I'd, I'd like to try to do. Just don't know whether I should. I do photography. I can't even go out and take a picture. Um, I'm going to put a few pictures in in this video here so you can see a little bit of what I've been trying to do. Um, uh, paracord um, things, bracelets and um, belts and I thought well instead of actually making an inventory like bracelets like this, instead of making an inventory and being stuck with all these things that I won't be able to sell, trying to make a, a dollar here or there to supplement my income a little bit. Um, I make zero money on, on YouTube and <coughs> now I find that I can't even uh, sell anything on Amazon through my affiliate account. Every time I do, I never get paid for it. So I contacted Amazon and asked them about that and they they can't tell me why. It's, it's against their rules and regulations to tell me why. Um, I did not get paid for certain things and certain items. Uh, for one, Camper Van Attic bought a diesel heater through my name. I, I've never met her. I don't know who she is. And yet they took that commission away from me. It was a few dollars. Like, it's not a lot. Amazon's a rich company. Like, why wouldn't they pay me? And they had, they can't tell me why. Um, when I made a video, or m did they follow through my email when I asked her to go instead of going to Amazon and ordering it? Um, um, did they follow my email when I suggested certain things uh, for her to go and find? And she says, where can I buy a Canadian, uh, a place where I can buy it from in Canada? I don't remember if I gave that to her in a YouTube video c uh, comment or in an email, but they're obviously following things that they shouldn't really be following. And like I said, I, I don't know her. I, I've never met her at all. S yet they, they took away that commission for me from me. And everything she does buy from now on, 
I will never get commission for. So if they keep doing that, I just don't want to. Why would I want to advertise for a company and never get paid for it? Like it's happened lots of times already, and I just don't know why. Now I know why. Uh, they took so many things away from me. I still have it on my um, in my description all the links to uh, the different items that I I uh, have bought from Amazon and uh, I'm hoping people still go through my links and shop it gives me a dollar or two to uh, make a little bit of an income not much at all I've been thinking about removing it completely so anyways guys um, please put your thoughts in the comment it doesn't hurt at all uh, it's absolutely free to do um, I haven't been going out and watching other my subscribers videos because I've been just um, just totally worried about all kinds of things um, I'm not living up to my my standards and I've, I've noticed it a lot that uh, a lot of my subscribers don't even come and watch my videos when I put them out. Um, my views have gone down by threefold. Um, and I don't blame them one single bit uh, for not coming and, and watching. Um, I've tried to liven up my live streams a little bit, playing games and trying to invite people into play games. So I'm going to put up a video. Um, oh, sorry, I'm on Sunday. I'm going to have another Sunday Fun Day game day where I take the six uh, winners from the last uh, six lettered scramble game and come up with one winner and um, give a uh, Amazon gift card for, for that winner. So I'm not trying to buy players. I'm not trying. Um, I don't feel that because I'm giving an Amazon gift card that it means anything as buying my uh, subscribers. Um, that's one thing I really frown on. When a subscriber finally gets up to 1,000 subscribers and 4,000 watch hours, they can start um, monetizing and then they start begging for money. They put up little click things in here and there to, to try to get money like to me I, I don't like that at all I, I hope I will never do that um, I would like to make a little bit of an income from somewhere you put out videos all the time uh, nothing ever comes of it um, at least I would like comments that's what I enjoy the most is comments I love to read them I comment back to every single one of them um, I have a thousand subscribers uh, just over a thousand subscribers and maybe 40 people view my videos and more than half of those are not even subscribers so what does that tell you that 15 or 20 views on my videos are my subscribers out of a thousand um, I'm sorry if it uh, if my uh, videos offend anyone. Um, that's not what I'm about at all. I I want my videos to be to be viewed and, and enjoyed. So that's why I'm doing my branding change. <clears throat> I'd love to put something in there that would pique your interest, that would keep you interested, keep you coming back for more. Um, I am nobody special. I don't pretend to be. I don't run out and say um, you guys are all awesome because you should know that you are all awesome you you touch my heart when I say that uh, you are awesome um, it's like I have a, a second family actually you are my first family I don't even have a, um, a first family so when I see you commenting and I see you on other <clears throat> when I go to your channels and, and watch I uh, ap appreciate each and every one of you very very much 
uh, you absolutely do not know and understand how much I really do appreciate each and every one of you. So if I can make it up to all of you, please, by all means, comment below this video right here and uh, tell me what you think I should be doing as far as videos and live streams. Um, am I too animated? Am I um, not doing something right? Um, that's where the thumbs down when I made the video about the thumbs down, um, I studied all about thumbs up and thumbs down. And I appreciate the thumbs down more than you can think that I do. I just wish that those people would give, that are giving the thumbs down would comment and tell me why they gave that thumbs down. I don't hate anyone for giving me a thumbs down. It makes me think of what was it about that video that made someone give the thumbs down. I could, I can try to correct those things. I can try to make it better for that person. And you don't have to feel obligated that you have to give a thumbs up. But by all means, that that's not the whole idea. Personally, I wish they would do away with the thumbs completely. Thumbs up and thumbs down. The thumbs thing means a lot to people that show the count and can live with themselves for the count and not to say like and dislike because the person that has that on there, they still see the numbers of thumbs up and down. So it's to me like hiding from the fact you don't like to have thumbs down. So they don't, but they still have the like and dislike. It makes no sense to me. That's just my personal opinion on that. So anyways, guys, I hope, again, once again, I hope that you can comment below and not feel afraid to, and speak your mind. Tell me what you really think, honestly, um, about what I should do. Should I stop YouTube completely? Should I carry on? Um, tell me what I'm doing wrong. Um, tell me what I'm doing right. Um, it gives me some encouragement. And please, by all means, comment. And, and, and if you really want to make it private, then email me. By all means, email me at nomadicvanman1 at gmail.com. And if you remember the old one, kingtathat at gmail.com. And uh, they're all in the description below. Well, Nomadic Van Man 1 is in the description. Um, please, let me know what you think, guys. And we'll catch you guys all on the next one. Because I believe you are all awesome. And stay true to the Nomadic Outlaws. Please, guys.